Hi guys, my name is Awkward Zombie and welcome to the uh, prologue bit of Dead Island, which is called Rise and Shine. Uh, from the little uh, cutscene, we've woken up in a hotel bedroom. Uh, yeah, some drinking was obviously going on here last night and some getting naked. Okay, let's take a look around. Um, it doesn't matter which character you pick initially, uh, each one wakes up in the same uh, hotel room. Same scenario begins for each character. Okay. Find the emergency staircase. Oh. Okay, there's been some murder in here. Oh, God. Um, in terms of graphics, they're okay. I can't pick that up. Um, not massively exciting. Maybe there's something in here. You found a constituent part of a modifying a weapon? Cool. Um, very much like Left 4 Dead. If you like Left 4 Dead, then this is the game for you. Um, I see very little difference after playing it for 20 minutes previously. And obviously there's this part of the game which is essentially you can you can loot your little heart out. You can uh well let's assume they're all dead, so there's no guilt involved. Um if the zombie apocalypse has occurred, then I'm not entirely sure why we do need to take money anyway. That's enough of that. Anything in here? Fourteen dollars. Okay, cool. Um, this is a game that rewards you, obviously, for exploring around. Oh, what did you hear? Ah, there you go. Um, it does reward you for looking around. I think at the moment <laughs> it's not <laughs> going to massively be helpful apart from I'll have two hundred dollars that I can't spend but I assume that later on in the game we'll be picking up modifications for weapons, extra items for health etc. Anything in here? No. And as you can see on the bottom right of the screen there's a nifty little map that instructs you where you need to be going. Sprint. Elevator hatch. Uh, so there it is. How am I going to open it? It's not giving me the option. Let's back it up. Ah, oh, okay. Through the camera. Feeling all right, mate? No shakes? Fever? Chills? Good. I'll introduce myself later. Right now, we got to get you the hell out of there. Do exactly as I say, okay? You're going to have to trust me. First, you need to get hold of a weapon. Search in the maintenance storage room by the end of the corridor. I would move if I were you. Now. Ah, 
Okay, <laughs> we're and we're off. Just a bit further. They were not that close. Come on. Not a bloody executioner. Hmm. Okay then. So we got someone going crazy in the corner. Bless her. Uh, yeah, not happy. Understandable. Stephen. Fuck! I should have never listened to Cinemoy. Yeah, damn Cinemoy. Uh, we can't really interact with these characters. Is there anything to take? What the hell things is came for us and Cinemoy went out to kill them alone. Bloody hell, Margaret. There's Come on. I'm dressed as lamb. Help him. He's dead. We Look, won't anyone help no him. You can't just let him that. die out there. He saved your life. You owe him your life. Mm. Okay then. Do we take that? Yes, no? You going out there? Are you nuts? You're not gonna help me. Get the hell out of the way. You at least have a weapon? You need to find a weapon. It's really difficult to watch um, CGI characters after playing L.A. Noir and their, you know, facial expressions are pretty much non existent. That game has spoiled right. us forever. This is fucking crazy. On three. I assume one, right trigger is going to be fuck it. Uh, attack. So we'll just go with that and hope for the best. <laughs> any more for any more? Over where? That's the last one? Okay then. Thanks, mates. Just attacked. Listen, your friend from the hotel's awake. You were right about him being immune to this thing. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have made it. Maybe now we can hold out until help arrives. There is no help. This thing can't be stopped. I saw how it took my wife. You need to get out of there, and I can help you. I can arrange for transportation by air, by sea, but first you need to get here to me. I have many sick and injured here, mate. They're crazy with fear. Tell me where you are. Where are you? You there, mate? Hello? Hello? Oh, God damn it. Just touch and go with you for a while. Good. Ooh, level up. Yeah, the voice acting. <laughs> I'm not impressed with the voice acting. That These cutscenes are... Not impressive. The dialogue is not particularly exciting. It's all, all of it contrived. Right, I'll leave you there with that. Um, and I will see you next time, guys. Thank you very much for watching. And if you liked, please make sure you favourite and give me a subscribe. See you later.